Hi. So, originally, I was just going to make another blog post about some random stuff, including the fact that I have still not emailed back my Bubby and Zadie. They've sent me an email, I believe it was last week sometime. So yeah, been procrastinating on that. And I was going to make a rant about how I really dislike emailing. I do. It's not fun. I don't like it. It's like a step easier than a letter, and yet not as convenient as just messaging you on Facebook. And Mazidi has a Facebook, but he doesn't go on it. So I was going to make a video about that, and then I decided, why not just make my Bubby and Zadie a video? Huh? Yeah, cool idea. That's what I thought. Hi, Bubby and Zadie! How's it going? What up? This is me in video format. I'm making you a video, which is happy and exciting, and I'm excited about making you a video. Um, I really hope this works on your computer, because otherwise that'd be sad, because I'm going to put a lot of effort into this, like much more effort than I would making an email, really. How are you? I'm fine. Having lots of fun at school. Uh, you guys have a pretty good computer, right? So you can, you can watch YouTube videos, right? You should tell me if you can't watch the video, which you wouldn't know that you should tell me that if the video doesn't work. So I'm going to make sure to add that when I send you the link to this. And I'm going to actually have to email you. So, hi. How's it going? I'm pretty good. This is my dorm room. Here, I'll give you a little tour. It'll be cool. So this is the room. It's a very nice room, as you can see. Very cool bed. I really like this blanket. It's so cool and colorful and awesome. And, and my posters and stuff. And that's Crystal's bed. Crystal's my roommate. She's not here right now, which is why I'm making you this video. Because I'd feel really awkward making this video if she was actually watching me make this video. Refrigerator and Crystal's microwave. It's very cool. Uh, fan. We like the fan when it's warm. It's not so warm anymore, so the fan's not on. Here's the other fan. Whoa. Yeah, we needed both of them, though. That's my, my dresser. Well, I'm on the right side with the dishes and stuff, and Crystal's like all the beauty products. Yeah, moving on. Uh, my closet. Crystal's closet. Not that interesting. My desk. Yeah. That's a cool desk. I just cleaned it off so that way I can actually use it because it was like cluttered with stuff and not very useful. But um, yeah, this is my shelving. It's really high and awesome. Um, you can tell what my priorities are because you can see that the food is on like the actual shelf space and then the textbooks are all like just piled haphazardly on top of it. Actually, it's more convenient to have the books up there like that because my bed is right there and I often do studying slash homework while on my bed so if you can see if I'm like up here then I can reach that better than if it was like stacked properly on a shelf or something silly like that. I suppose I should actually respond to the things that you emailed me about. You asked me about orchestra. I, I did audition for orchestra. The audition did not go so well. I did not make it into like the symphony or chamber strings orchestra so I'm just in like the all university string orchestra which is like much easier and kind of cool because then I don't have to put so much effort into it I guess I don't know I'm okay with it so it's it's fun it'll be fun school school is going good I am in a fig 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 yeah um, it stands for first year interest group so what it is, is that um, there's 20 students that are in the FIG, and they all take, they take three classes together. My FIG is Classic Mythology and Modern American Culture. Yeah, really long name. I can barely remember it, but I just did impressive. We are taking Latin, which is really hard. Latin is really hard, but it's it's enjoyable and cool and I'm learning fun stuff about English and French, so it's got to be helpful. Then um Integrated Liberal Studies 203 Literature and the Arts 1. Yes, that is also a very long name. It is um basically what we do is we read like Homer and Dante and um Virgil and other stuff like that. Like the stuff that's the basis for Western culture, and then we talk about it and we compare it, like, um, 
the professor she puts like slides of like famous art paintings and we analyze that in the context of what we're reading and in the context of the time period it's from it's really interesting I really love that class so that's two and um then our third class which is like the main class for the fig it's just the 20 of us in the in the fig with a professor so it's really cool it is English 155 mythology and literature so for that we're studying mythology and literature. No, we're supposedly reading some mythology and something by Sherman Alexie later in the semester. I'm just kind of looking at the syllabus as I need to to figure out what I need to do for homework. Right now, we're actually looking at like buildings around campus, like the Humanities Building and stories people tell about campus. And I have to take a walking tour of campus at some point before Wednesday, so I should probably get on that. And then we're writing haikus of our experiences around campus. It's a really fascinating class and it's just like the 20 of us and we all know each other so well by now because we're in three classes together. Um, we're also in Latin together, it's just the 20 of us because Latin's a small class like that so that's kinda cool that we have two classes, just the 20 of us and then we have our giant lecture too which is the ILS class. And I'm also taking French, it's like level 5 French it's interesting. I don't know. It's it's French. I like French. I think it'd be kind of cool to be fluent in French. I'm, I'm getting there. The other thing that you wanted to know about was if there were any kids from Interlaken that I met at Hillel. And there were some. I met some, but not really close with them. And I'm not really planning to be close with them. But I met a bunch of other cool people at the Hillel. They're all upperclassmen, actually. And there's this one, like, middle-aged grad student, and she's really cool. And we were at the Break the Fast dinner last night, because last night was the end of Yom Kippur. And she was like, anyone want to go to Ikea? And we were like, now? She's like, no, not now, like, sometime later this week. So I'm possibly going to Ikea sometime later this week. Actually, my former counselor from Interlochen, Ilana, is, she works at the Hillel which is kind of cool because she's like running the services and she's like, hey, Brene, do you want to take this reading? This was on Rosh Hashanah. And I was like, sure. So I, I led part of the service, you know, like two pages of the service, but I led part of the service. So let's see what else is going on in my life. My mom brought me cookies that she baked and they're delicious. I don't know, not much. School, more school, hanging out with people. So I hope that answered all your questions sufficiently. I hope you really enjoyed the video format and the impromptu tour of my room. So yeah, let me know if you want me to make you more videos. Um, if you didn't like the video, you should also tell me that and then I suppose I'll have to email you. Um, yeah. Bye! Talk to you guys later. Look at me, I'm such a college student with my ramen noodles.